Hey guys, what's up? This is Adam from FXDude79.com, uh, <clears throat> which, by the way, little ad for myself is redesigned uh, with a new design page for our Cydia applications and Rock applications, so just check that out. FXDude79.com and design.fxd79.com for the Cydia stuff. But, onto the tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to play Game Boy games on your iPhone. Crazy, right? Yes, I know. I bet you didn't know you could do that. Now you know. Um, anyway, so let's go ahead and get into the tutorial. You are going to need a program called iFile from Cydia, a program called GB for iPhone. By the way, this is all in the new underbar. Yay, YouTube, for changing things up on us again. Um, you're also going to need uh, a program from the internet, which you can find, called GBA underscore BIOS dot bin. Um, and also. Uh, you'll need ROMs, which you can get, and I will explain that later. So that's, uh, that's I think, all you're going to need. Um, if I have any more, I'll add it in later. Um, basically, you're going to need to, first of all, download GB for iPhone, install it from Cydia or Rock. It's free. Um, then you need to go onto your Safari application and search for GBA underscore BIOS dot bin. I'm just showing you on the large screen here. Um, but basically you need to go under your iPod, um, you're going to need a download manager, that's the other thing. Um, you can get that from Cydia or Rock. If you have Installus, you already have a download manager, don't worry about it. Um, basically you just need to go to your Safari, search on Google for GBA BIOS.bin. If you can't find it, please don't ask anybody for it, they will not be able to give it to you. And uh, just do a Google search, I guarantee you will find one. Um, download it from the site, and once you get your little download screen, Go ahead and download that redundancy. Um, and then you can go into iFile, and you're going to find the place where the BIOS file was saved. And that should be under, I believe, var mobile library um, and then downloads. So it should be under there. It should be, you know, the Ben file. Um, so basically, just hit edit and then copy the file. And then you can go into back and go into uh, it should be under uh, var mobile library roms and you need to copy that file in there once you have GB for iPhone installed it should have a little text file that says insert Ben file here so just insert it where it says insert it paste it in there and you should be good to go um, that'll install the full program because there's some parts the Ben file cannot be distributed on Cydia for a reason I won't go into but um, once you've done that you can just respring your iPhone and the uh, GB for iPhone icon will appear on your springboard. Springboard, yeah. Um, and so you'll have that. And basically, you just need to download ROMs to play, which are basically, um, if you've ever had a Game Boy, you know you have those little um, card things that like you insert into your Game Boy, and that'll like you know you have to change them out. It's pretty much the same with any game system. But um, basically, ROMs are the ripped version of that. So people take that and rip it onto a file so that you can play it. Um, so basically, you just need to download that so that the um, the GB for iPhone can read them and be able to play them. They're uh, all free, although I have to give you a little bit of a warning here. Um, playing and downloading ROMs and keeping them for more than a day is illegal, so make sure, <coughs> cough cough, that you have the program, the uh, games that you are downloading and that you delete them after one day. Um, so anyways make sure you do that to comply with the rules and everything and we'll all be happy. Anyways, okay so um, basically to get ROMs you need to go on Safari and search for the game you want to play plus ROM and that'll usually bring you to a ROM site and you'll have you know a free download. Um, you have to move it from the downloads folder back into the ROMs folder along with the BIOS just like you did with the BIOS file unless you go to Cydia or Rock and download um, excuse me um, you need to download or you don't need to but it's a healthy little little tip um, you can download Unlim ROMs that's like unlimited but U-L-I-M-R-O-M-S and uh, that'll basically you can download ROMs there really fast and uh, it'll download them right to the ROMs folder. You don't need to move them with iFile or anything, so that's cool. Um, and that's pretty much it. You just open up GB for iPhone. You got your skins and everything for your Game Boy. 
and uh, you can have a fun time playing those and impressing your friends. Obviously, you will need a jailbroken iPod. I think that goes without saying. If you haven't figured that out yet, you're stupid. Um, sorry. But, yeah. Okay, so, uh, this... I'm not sure if I said it earlier, because I've recorded this a few times, but this is the 100th FX Seed 79 video, which is really amazing. It's awesome. Um, so we're going to have a 100th video special. I've done some really cool things. Um, I won't tell you too much, but we're going to have tutorials, and I won't say any more than that, because uh, we've got some cool stuff planned for that. Um, but make sure you visit my website. And, oh, also... Um, one of our videos, the How to Make Sugar Last video for a long time ago, got sponsored by YouTube, and now they're serving up ads on there, so I get some ad revenue off of that, which is awesome, because it has like 25,000-something views. Uh, they gave me the email, it's become popular. So hopefully that's just the first of those videos that become popular. So thank you guys for commenting and watching and sharing. Uh, I really appreciate that. Um, it's a big help. So, again, if you want to check out, uh, while we're on the topic of jailbreaking, I have a theme for iPhone called Modern Wood and Caps Theme. So, if you can check those out on the City or Rock Store, download them, share them, whatever. Uh, or if you just want to go to design.effectsdude79.com, you can check out all my design projects, uh, including all the themes, and uh, request your own theme, which I will explain there. But um, that's pretty much it for this. I will see you guys in the next video tutorial and the next video and stuff like that. Alright, peace guys.